Hello everybody, welcome to Iron Deck. I'm your host, Peter. And today, we're going for it. That's right, this is my round two. I'm feeling really good about this. Feel really good about it. But first, we have beautiful Nissa. Very special thanks to Grego Gaming. We'll put all of their information in the description. Um, they make all these great play mats. You get an emblem emblem card with it, doubles as a business card. It's pretty cool. Uh, this playmat in particular kind of has all the all the little setup. You got your phases down here. It's, just, it's very cool. And look, lands in the back. Lands go down here. Does that annoy anybody? I don't know. It triggers me sometimes. Anyway, back to this, the good old stuff. Yeah, so... Um, we're gonna we're gonna open up a couple boxes here, and we got a damaged box, so we know that that that's just nothing but textured cards, whether whether by wizards or the UPS guy. <laughs> All right, why don't we just get to it then, huh? Double masters, twenty twenty two. Here we go. Four whole packs in this. Yeah, this is, look at this, they're, they're not even, we got three on one side and one on the other side. Oh, this, this box, I know this box is going to be spicy, I feel it. Here we go. Pack number one. All right. Got that there, here we go. Trying to keep the glare at a minimum here. I have used uh, Amazon Prime Day to order some lighting so hopefully uh the next video i make will be better in terms of this uh reflection especially with all these foil cards foil spell pierce rancor oh look a rancor uh abzan charm here we go <clears throat> full art taylor swift spear a wall of omens seeker of the way common selesnia sanctuary and the first rare Necrotic Ooze, Panharmonicon, ah, Kaladesh, right? Was that Kaladesh or was that Aether Revolt? Either way, same uh, universe. Fiery Justice, very cool card. Ooh, it's a fairy's protection, and that's pack number one. Okay. Not too shabby first pack. I don't know if I need another to fairy's protection, but it's all right. It's okay. I'm all right. Things are fine. All right. Demir Aqueduct. Spell Pierce, can always use those. A Pride Mage. Inquisition of Kozilek, great card and great art. All right. Got the Lich Queen, not great. Seasoned Pyromancer, very cool card. Mythic, number one. Marchesa, the Black Rose. This is a pretty good etching, actually. The card's readable. Oh, yes. Full art, foil, Liliana. Not textured, but beautiful card. All right. I told you this was going to be a good box. Two packs in. Let's keep it going. All right. Got a bunch of these cards. Although, don't sit on these. I mean, you know, foil, young pyromancer. That's not bad. All right. Simic, growth chamber. Thought scour. Oops. Is it Boilerworks? Azorius Chancery, first rare. Leviathan. Ooh, felt like an oracle. That's a decent card. Foil, Elenda, the Dark Rose. The Dusk Rose, sorry. Also good etching. And, ooh, full art foil. Smothering Tithe. Gosh, that gold is stunning. Can you see it? Is it is it is it focusing? There we go. Sorta. Gosh, this lighting is horrible, huh? That's a good. That's good. All right, here we go. Pack number four. Let's keep it going. Mhm. 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 So prices have come down on this set in terms of the expected value, but fear not. It happens when the market gets flooded. These are, uh, 
you know, beautiful, unique cards. I think these, these full art treatments are just absolutely stunning. And I think they'll hold up. There you go, a couple blood artists. Here we go, Gifts Ungiven. Jace and Jace. Ooh, Forbidden Orchard. I will never complain about a rare land cycle. Grand Arbiter and oh, Chaos Warp. Beautiful artwork. Okay. I think that first box was not too shabby. Let's put those here. Right there, and let's go box number two. Uh, I can't do it, there we go. I believed in myself and I willed it to happen. Cardboard and cardboard. These packs are all lined up, which means they're gonna be full of garbage. <laughs> all right, here we go. All right, go through these. Just taking a quick look. Ooh, Cold Seal Heart, I think that's a decent card. Here we go. Gruel Turf. Radkos Carnarium. Burning Tree Emissary. Beautiful card. Not a big value hit, but stunningly beautiful card. Another Young Pyromancer. Full Art Foil this time. All right, first rare. Blood Forge Battle Axe. Oh, there we go. Aether Vile. Full art with the Kaladesh Invention Aether Vial. Stunning. Green Sun Zenith, another good card. And Gifts Ungiven, an okay card. All right, getting through these. We've got a Pride Mage and a Young Pyromancer. Foil on Earth, an Eternal Witness. All right, here we go. First rare, Abzan Ascendancy. <gasps> Ren N6 Full Art. Yep. Beautiful. A console of allocation and Mana Drain Foil. Mythic. Oh my goodness. Yep. Yeah, I, I said I felt good about these. I feel like these boxes are better than my first two boxes. My first two boxes weren't bad. I know I was hard on them when I was opening them, but gosh, boy, a textured card would just really top this off. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> come on now. All right, Oracle, Boros Garrison, a blinding mirrored monetary Taylor Swift Spear. Bloodbraid Elf, there we go. That is a playable card, even though it's uncommon uh, value-wise. But uh, yeah, definitely playable. I'm happy with that. All right, Yahini, Undying Partisan. City of Brass, full art. Decent rare, beautiful artwork. Good old Mark Poole, still at it. Oh. Foil, etched, force of negation. Hello, and a bloom tender full art foil. Yep. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Good boxes. <laughs> all right, last pack. Hope you all enjoyed watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe. It really helps. Uh, uh, our channel. We're going to continue to grow. We're going to continue to open up some product here. And uh, yeah. All right. Let's end with a bang here. Yeah. Lightning bolt. Can't have too many of those. Rampant growth. Ooh. Coiling Oracle with good old RKF. Crazy art he's been putting out for this set. Mole Drifter. Here we go. First art. Uh, first rare is a mythic. Ariella, the war leader, Mythic 1. Sensei's Divining Top. Decent rare, I would say. Dauntless Effort. And finally, boom. Ooh, freaking hell. What a pack. What a, what a couple boxes. So not etched, but uh, 
Ulamog, Infinite Gyre, Full Art, Foil, Mythic. <sighs> I, you know? Yeah, I'm feeling good about that, especially compared to the last two. Um, great cards. Uh, what a great set. Uh, prices are going up. Boxes are going up in price. They're starting to get close to the $300 mark uh, for four packs of cards. So just remember, the first Double Masters set was $100 for one pack of cards. Everybody flipped out, and now they're $200 a pack. Uh, will these follow in its footsteps? You know, figure $100 a pack, so a $400 box uh, versus um, versus sticking around at uh, $290. I, I don't think they're going to stick around at $290, $300, uh, I think, as time goes. This product will uh, age pretty well. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day.